Let's talk about nice, another nice day. Yeah. Uh, tomorrow a little different. Yeah, we have some changes in store. You wouldn't know it by looking out at the coast today. Absolutely beautiful. Look at everyone down by the water there. We're definitely going to see a different picture tomorrow, but let's talk today. Temperatures are nice and warm, close to 70 degrees in Lincoln City, 68 Pacific City, mid 60s for Long Beach and mid 60s for Astoria. So nice and warm out along the coast. Close to 90 degrees in Lake Oswego, 80 degrees in Westland, upper 70s, Beaverton, Hillsborough, right around 80 and mid 80s for Sherwood. Currently at PDX, about 79 degrees, upper 70s for Vancouver, 78 for Gresham. Moving out towards Hood River in the low 80s this afternoon, 85 degrees for the Dalles and upper 70s in Parkdale. Eastern Oregon, a little bit cooler than yesterday, upper 80s for Redmond, Bend, 84, and then the 90s for La Grande. Salem temperatures in the mid 80s this afternoon again. We were in the mid 80s yesterday, so a little bit cooler as this next system moves into our area or approaches. So about four to, into five degrees cooler, so not a major change. Tomorrow we will be even cooler. Here's a look at the wind. So very calm along the coast this afternoon. You notice we're usually 10 to 15 miles per hour. Not too bad. Perfect beach day. Pretty calm through Portland, but winds are picking up, especially through Hood River and the Dalles. Gusty winds through Hood River around 20 to 25 miles per hour and almost 30 miles per hour towards the Dalles this afternoon. Now let's talk about these changes. So mostly sunny skies for this evening. No rain in store for tonight. Overnight clouds. Now tomorrow we will see increasing clouds throughout the day for our Thursday with possible light rain to drizzle along the coast. Warming for the weekend though and upper 80s and sunshine back in the forecast. Here's that temperature trend. So we will cool down quite a bit for tomorrow into the upper 70s. So by no means will it be cold. Low 80s for Friday, a warm weekend ahead. Head, close to 90 degrees and then we slowly cool back down Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. Now here's a look at the next approaching system. We can see it swirling off the coast. They're already starting to see some showers up off the coast of Washington. That will slowly move into our area late tonight, early tomorrow morning. Here's a look at that rain and cloud forecast. So again, we start to see a few clouds this evening, but here comes the majority of the rain right along the beaches early tomorrow morning. We might see light pockets of light rain or some drizzle around the valley. I don't think it will be heavy by any means. Eastern Oregon is in the clear. Lots of sunshine tomorrow. As we move through the day, Clouds slowly start to clear. We're still going to see a mix of sun and clouds throughout the day Thursday, and then we clear out again for Thursday evening into Friday with a few more clouds. So when I say light rain, here's one of the rain total forecasts. We're talking less than a tenth of an inch out towards Astoria and Newport. We might see a sprinkle, but most of that will be in the higher terrain or out along the coast tomorrow, and then by the afternoon time, We'll start to see some sun breaks. So for tonight, temperatures in the 60s, pretty mild evening, increasing clouds. Tomorrow morning, we'll see cloudy start. Again, possible drizzle here and there, low 60s. Tomorrow afternoon, increasing sunshine, but still a mix of sun and clouds, a mild day, high in the upper 70s. Out along the coast tomorrow, mid 60s, again, rain chances, mostly in the morning, upper 70s for the I-5 corridor, and sunny and warm for eastern Oregon. Next seven days, still looking good. It's going to be a very warm weekend, so once we get through tomorrow, and upper 70s are not cold mm. by any means. No. Uh, so still looking pretty good for the weekend, dry.